1969, the scientists at Draper Laboratory on the campus at MIT helped put the first man on the moon. And this week, the lab is opening its doors to the public. WBZ's Ana Ritas Rodriguez shows us what's inside. So when I throw this ball in the hoop, the gyroscope will measure where it's pointing in the direction, and the accelerometers inside of the IMU will measure its distance. Draper Showcase is designed to let the public see what it's been working on, like this simulator. If you hold down the red trigger, which will allow you to simulate landing the Dream Chaser. One day, the real spacecraft will take supplies to the ISS. Their tech is also being used by patients at Brigham and Women's Hospital. Kenneth Markowski is part of the team that developed this breath analysis diagnostics system. It's helped with the early detection of serious respiratory infections. Breathing into it for about uh, three to four minutes, we're able to make that diagnosis and determine whether they have the biomarkers for invasive aspergillosis and treatment can begin right away. So this is saving people money. This is yes. saving lives. It most will of save all. lives. Draper's EP17 showcase runs through Saturday, 9 to 4, and it's open and free to the public. In Cambridge, I'm Anna Rodriguez, WBZ News.